Hello ladies and gentlemen, we are back with another video and this time it's a new series but kind of not a new series. Confused? Let me explain. This is GPW Succession uh, and this is not the first episode of the series but it is the first episode of the series on my channel. What this series is, is basically me, Charles and Jack currently I have created the save where we have two months each um, with the with this company GPW, and it's, it's a save that gets passed on from one person to another. I am currently the second person holding the save. Um, before me, it was Charles, so make sure to check out his channel if you want to see what's been going on in this company. Um, before I took over, he had his two months. We'll go over them in a minute, and yeah. This um, is my two months. Next, it will be Jack's. And uh, next, who knows? It could be you. If uh, if you're interested in joining this series, if you're interested in continuing the save and booking two months yourself, you can just post a comment in the description, and we'll hit you up on Skype. And yeah, you can you can be part of the series. So this is the third month I am going to do September and October and let's go over um, the roster first so it's it's quite a small roster we're a reg regional company we've got Aaron Stevens Alex Shelley Amazing Red Brian Hebner Chris Hero Chris Saban Cody Rhodes Colt Cabana Eric Young this is just a person from our dojo we're not using her yet Eric Young uh, Ethan Carter the Third, Extreme Tiger, Frankie Kazarian, Johnny Nitro, Carol Carnage, which is Charles's um, character, Kevin Kiley, Magnus, Matt Jackson, Matt Sidal, Matt Sidal, Nick Jackson, Noam Dar, OTS, Ricky Steamboat, Ricochet, Sebastian Holmichael, who's an announcer, Taz, who's our color commentator and our GM. TJ Perkins, Will Ospreay, and Zack Sabre Jr. So, let's let's go over the titles. We have currently three titles. Our GPW Heavyweight Champion is Cody Rhodes. Our GPW Super Lightweight Champion is Zack Sabre Jr. And King of Combat is a tournament that I will be holding in October. I am going to be the booker for this tournament. It's held every October. Excited for that. The winner of this tournament does go on to main event, our, our WrestleMania, which is GPW TakeOver, against the champion at the time. So, let's go into the show history. Uh, let's go over the two pay-per-views we've had so far. GPW Absolution is where Cody Rhodes won his first, uh, one became the first ever GPW heavyweight champion. And uh, Zack Sabre Jr., Defended his super lightweight title against Frankie Kazarian. And Rampage, which just happened. Uh, I should, could probably go over that. Frankie Kazarian defeated TJ Perkins and Ricochet. Chris Hero defeated Global Lions, which is me and... Uh, which is OTS, my character, and Charles' character, Carl Carnage. Uh, Zack Sabre Jr. defeated Chris Sabin to retain the super lightweight title. Johnny Nitro defeated Magnus. Eric Kelly defeated Cole Cabana. Cody Rhodes defeated Aaron Stevens, and post-match, Magnus attacked Cody Rhodes. So, we currently have no figurehead. Our announce, uh, announce team is Sebastian, Hall, Michael, and Taz. We, should we, I'll go over the creative meeting with you guys quickly. Our franchise players are Johnny Nitro, Epicard the Third, Cody Rhodes, Magnus, and Chris Saban. Next Big Things... O me and Charles as his characters, OTS and Carl Carnage, Hot Prospects, same, but with Nick Jackson, Noam Dar, and our dojo person, Elaine Alexander. Talk the talk, Taz, Aaron Stevens, Cody Rhodes, Rookie Steamboat, and Ethan Carter the third. Showstoppers, Frankie Kazarian, Alex Shelley, Johnny Nitro, Mas Masai Dow and Chris Saban. Ring Generals, Frankie Kazarian, Alex Shelley, me, uh, Masai Dow, and Chris Saban. Who's hot? Eric Young. Chris Saban, Aaron Stevens, Cody Rhodes, Chris Hero, Who's Not, Colt Cabana, Matt Seidel, Frankie Gazarian, Matt Jackson, Ricochet, and Time Decline is Chris Hero. 
So, it seems, I don't know what else to tell you, or else to tell you, it seems like you're all caught up, so I've booked an episode of GPW Ascension, which is our TV show, and let's get right into it. My first show as the booker of GPW. Exciting. Let's go. In a pre-show bout that had good wrestling and a decent reaction from the crowd, Cody Rose defeated TJ Perkins in 616 by pinfall of a beautiful disaster. 74 B minus, quite a good match. Cody Rhodes kind of carried. And 67 C plus in our next pre-show bout. In a pre-show bout that had good wrestling and a decent reaction from the crowd, Ethan Carter III defeated Matt Jackson in an 823 by pinfall for Sweet Meat Sizzler. Sizzler. Sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. Yeah, decent match. Any work improvements? No. So let's start the show. We start the show with Taz announcing uh, the main event for tonight will be Magnus vs. Johnny Nitro, a rematch from uh, our last pay per view, of course. And the winner will be the official number one contender for the GPW heavyweight title. Next segment. In a 60C, in a decent match, Chris Hero defeated Cole Caban in 8.49 by pinfall with an emerald elbow during the match. We also had Eric Young run and attack Cabana. So yeah, Eric Young and Cole Cabana have been have been uh, in a feud since, since this save has started. Basically, it started with Colt Cabana and Eric Young originally teaming, teaming together, but Eric Young becoming increasingly frustrated with Colt Cabana not taking the matches seriously and losing the matches for them, which eventually ended up in Eric Young turning on Colt Cabana, angry about how happy, happy and go lucky Colt Cabana always was. Next segment, in a... C-58, Motor City Machine Guns attack Zack Sabre backstage, leaving him down and out. So, Zack Sabre Jr., our super lightweight champion, and the Motor City Machine Guns, who both both are in contention and both really want another shot, or a shot at the GPW super lightweight title. Next segment. 75B-, minus, great match, and about had good wrestling and decent reaction for crowd. Motor City Machine Guns defeat the Global Lions in 7.35 when Alex Shelley defeated Carl Can- Carnage by pinfall of an underarm snap STO. Very decent match there. Hmm. Any work improvements? Chris Saban is improving in performance skills. Next segment. Aaron Stevens is backstage arguing with Matt Seidel. It gets heated and the shouting catches the attention of Taz, who is passing by. He walks in and decides to settle it by booking them to face each other in a singles match, which will be our next pay-per-view, Beat the Best. Our first match for Beat the Best is here. And it will be Aaron Stevens and Matt Seidel. That was a C plus 67. And let's go. In the main event, in the 74 B minus, and the battle had great heat and good wrestling, Johnny Nitro defeated Magnus in 1509 when Magnus intentionally got disqualified. What is Magnus playing at here? Doesn't want he want a shot at the heavyweight title? The next segment is another 74 B minus. Johnny Nitro is in the ring. Well, basically, this is post match. Magnus attacks Johnny Nitro and Cody Rhodes runs in tr- um, trying to protect Johnny Nitro. He, do- he wants the challenger in at his 100%. That's the kind of champion Cody Rhodes is. He's the one that will take on any challenger at any time and wants to prove that he's the best in this company. And we end off with a 73B minus good show. Uh, hope you enjoyed this for, uh, my first episode of GPW Succession. Make sure to check out uh, Charles's channel for the two months prior to my two months, and make sure to subscribe to Jack Bennett's channel, Jay Z Gaming, for the two months that will be after my two months. A lot of two months, and yeah, if you do want to be part of the series, just leave a comment, and yeah, you could be. Please like, subscribe, and bye.